how to build up a ISP company. Hello YouTubers, I am David Milan from AKS Net Lab. Today I will show you how to configure a full ISP company, that means ISP full setup. Before starting my tutorial, I want to say you something. If you really like my YouTube channel or YouTube video, please subscribe my channel. Thank you. Let's start. This is the central zone ISP and this is my ISP. This is my ISP. Uh, here is the central zone ISP information. And here is my ISP information. First of all, I have to configure central zone ISP. Then I have to configure my ISP company. I will divide this project into five parts. What topology must be configured to create this project? That means, what topologies I have to configure to complete my full project? Here is the list. Uh, router switch host name, router switch banner, telnet configuration, DNS server, DACP mail, PPU server, net configuration, log server, static route by default and so many more. So, in this video, I will configure central zone ISP. So let's start. This is my central zone ISP router. First of all, I have to change my router host name. Sorry. name is changed now I have to enable password by using this command service password encryption your password is now encrypted that means no one can show your password no one can see your password okay <coughs> exit now i have to configure banner banner mode q here i have to write my message what message uh this router is last I have to use Q. Here is the message. Enter text message. End with the character Q. That means uh, after write your message you have to enter Q. Okay. Press enter. Exit. Now I will check. Yes. Here is my router banner and password right. okay. now i have to configure ip address first of all i have to establish a link here is the link uh what is my link port number mm, maybe it is first zero slash zero okay now i have to configure ip address zero slash zero I have entered in my port now assign IP address IP address what is my IP address my IP address is 145.188.16.0 cause 0 is the network ID and I have to enter net mass my CIDR is 28 255 255 Okay, no shut. No shut. By using this command, my link is up. It's showing green signal. 
that's mean my link is up uh, now I have to configure another group DNS server okay my DNS server IP block is 145.188.17.0 okay my DNS server port number is 1 slash 0 I have to enter in my port IP, my, my router port number interface first internet 1 slash 0 1 slash 0 IP address uh, IP address 145.188.17.1 and my mask is 255.255.255.245 no shot. Now I have to save this configuration on my startup config. So that's why I have to enter copy running config to startup config. Startup config. <coughs> Now my configuration is saved. Now go to DNS server and enter IP address 145.188.17.2 cause 145.188.17.1 is my gateway. And my mask is 255.240 and default gateway is 1. Paste one. Okay. I don't need assign DNS server because this is the DNS server. So check the connectivity. P one forty five one double eight uh one seven dot one. I am pinging on my gateway. Hmm. This it okay done. Then I have to configure HTTP server. I need a link. Here's the link. Now assign IP address. What will be my HTTP server IP address? My HTTP my HTTP server IP address will be one forty five one eight eight one six dot zero block because I will assign this block IP on router 0 slash 0 and my this link is up uh, by using router port number 0 slash 0 so that's why uh, my HTTP server IP address will be 145.188.16.2 cause 145.188.16.1 is my gateway my mask is 255.240 control c control p 1 and dns server my dns server ip address 145.188.17.2 okay now check the connectivity 145.188.17.2 okay now i will ping from http server to dns server okay ping i am pinging on my dns server ip address 145.188.17.2 okay too good it's done now i have to configure admin pc admin pc ip address collect from this block okay uh, my http server ip address was 2 so this will be 3 two five five two four zero. Uh, gateway 1 and dns server one four five one double eight one seven dot two. Okay. Check the connectivity. So, one four five 
1881862 okay this pin uh dn server 17.2 okay it's done uh now i have to configure router telnet uh by configuring telnet uh we can access router from pc okay uh first of all i have to configure access list why i will create access list if i create access list i can choose which pc will be access my router if i don't create access list every host on my network can be access my router that's why i have to configure access list it is network security issue cause uh i want to give access this pc okay so access list 1 permit access list 1 <coughs> permit host there is three option any host and address i will use host cause i just entry one pc not many more access list one permit host now assign ip address that mean host pc ip address my pc ip address is 3 145 18166.3 enter now i will configure telnet line bty 04 a uh, login local this class 1 in exit now i will create username and password username david password router ip address i will use 1451.16.1 to enter my router i will use 1451881.16.1 to enter my router uh username david password david123 okay It's working. It's working. Now I will. I can configure my router from this PC. Okay. Uh, now I have to configure DNS server for access HTTP HTTP server. Okay. Uh, DNS server. Go to DNS server service. dns on uh i want to add this server so enter this server ip address 1451881602 and what is my address c here www.centralisp.com i enter here Uh, 
one oh sorry mm, ip address will be here ip address will be here and name will be here www dot Uh, add now go to PC and use web address don't need use IP address okay. uh, you can ping by using this host name You don't need any IP address, just host name, domain name. Okay, uh, thank you. In the next part, I will configure my ISP company. Uh, this was only central ISP zone configuration. Uh, in the next video, I will configure my ISP company. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel and like my video and if you have any question uh, comment in the video i will give you answer as soon as possible thank you